www.ecclesiastical.class.co.uk The first step to preparing the chinchillas food and water is to clean the bowl and bottle. I'm going to spray these with a disinfectant. The disinfectant has been pre-diluted and put into a spray bottle. You need to be in contact with the surfaces of the bowl and the bottle for two minutes. Once this has happened, I can then rinse. Making sure I thoroughly remove any disinfectant. This is for demonstration purposes, but normally you would rinse under running water in the tap. Then I'm going to dry these items. And once they're dry, I'm ready to prepare the chinchillas food. I'm going to use this bowl to feed the chinchillas. I'm picking this type of bowl as it's a heavy ceramic dish that won't tip over. And as long as there are no chips in the surface, then it's not going to injure the chinchilla. I'm going to place this onto the scales and then make sure the reading is at zero so that I'm not weighing the bowl itself. Now we've got two types of food that we could feed to chinchillas. One is a pellet form and the other is a mix form. Both of these are complete diets. It's just a preference of which you prefer to use. In this case, I'm going to feed the mix. The recommended guidelines say that 33 grams should be fed to the chinchilla each day. So that's what we need to feed in the dry food. And to supplement the chinchilla, I want to offer some vegetables. When chopping these up, be very careful of the use of a sharp knife. The chinchilla needs approximately four to five pieces, no larger than my thumbnail. And that's our dry food ready. And now I'm going to move on to the water. I want to offer the, the chinchilla fresh water, and water is extremely important to any animal. I'm going to provide a full bottle. And this can be secured to the cage. And then I can monitor the amount of water that the chinchilla has drunk overnight. So now I'm ready to offer these to the chinchilla.